best stretches that we can do for our quadricep and hip flexor and both of them together is uh, using a step or you can use a chair or even your couch. Um, throw something soft on the floor, a pillow or a, a mat um, for your knee. But one of the ways we can do this, put your foot right up here and then just let your knee drop down to the pillow or the mat. We want this knee to be at 90 degree angle when we start and that will give us our ankle also at 90 degrees. We want to make sure that your shoulders stay above your hips. So you should be in a straight line here. And from this position here, a lot of, a lot of folks will feel that stretch right deep down into the quadricep all the way through just from this position here. But then when we want to incorporate the hip flexor stretch, we just start lunging forward, still maintaining a tall upper body, keeping your shoulders over your hips. But start lunge, just lunge your um, hips towards your foot, staying nice and tall. back dog, come back in again, and out. Now if we even wanted to focus more on the hip flexor, the abdominal area, we would raise our arm over our head, keeping your shoulders still over your, over your hips. Then when we want to work the inner thigh, the, the groin area of the hip flexor, you just open your hips up a little more, turning your shoulders away from the front knee. And then the same thing when we want to work the outer part of the hip flexor here, we would turn towards this knee when we run it in. 